The standard inflation indicator for all economies is the Consumer Price Index, or CPI. In order to compare a chosen number of items from one year to the next, it uses a basket of goods. Focusing on goods that people use and buy every day. Your milk, eggs, and toothpaste are some examples of items included in the CPI. The CPI is calculated by averaging the price changes for all items in the specified basket of products, weighing the item in accordance with its significance. The index bases its calculations on a base year. Therefore, changes are frequently presented as percentage changes to reflect earlier index levels. There are two CPI numbers, the CPIW for urban wage earners and clerical workers, and the CPIU for all urban consumers. The most closely monitored metric is the CPIU, which is usually represented by a seasonal adjustment because of seasonal variations in consumer behavior. The CPI is a detailed release that includes breakdowns from the majority of important consumer categories and geographical areas. The CPI is additionally used to pinpoint instances of deflation or inflation. Inflation is often indicated by a sharp increase in the CPI over a short period of time. Downward trends in the CPI often indicate deflation. Adjustments to cash flow mechanisms like pensions, Medicare, and cost of living are also made using the CPI. Because of its adaptability, the CPI has an impact on almost every market and individual worldwide. Thanks for watching. Do you want more videos like this? Leave a comment.